so part of my lounge, so welcome. Okay, I think we're done with the white. So this is where we are at, just to make sure we have the right side up. So that, can you see the outline of the boat? I hope you can do that again. I can. <laughs> yes, I can! Yes, I can! Yeah. It's coming together. I'm enjoying this. Are you enjoying this with me? Enjoy it with me, please. Now I'm going to do some yellow. It's a beautiful day to be alive, isn't it? I don't have yellow or shirt, so I'm gonna add some white to the yellow to make it a little bit um um styling a bit. Hopefully uh just it looks good and better. That's the beauty of it. Um I'm gonna put in some medium, maybe it might um to help you with some glaze or some glow. Just a little bit. Medium, there are different kinds of it. It, it basically helps your face if it's drying, or there's, there's the gloss one. There's the yeah, if you want a different texture, the medium can do that. But primarily, it's to help that's the shape we have now. It's to help with um, uh, basically the keeping your face alive and not completely dry. Okay, so we are now on the yellow. You guys must guess what my favorite colors are. <laughs> I'll tell you that yellow and purple are my favorite colors if you do not realize that already. Huh? You might wonder on my blog, why does she go with such bold, abstract images? But I'll tell you why. Because abstract is what I'm talking about. What I'm talking about, the questions I'm raising, See, most people don't think about such things. Most people, yeah, don't even know what spirituality is about. Or if that even is, if that even a thing. Huh? So, yeah. Um, things that are abstract needs to be shorter. So I, I chose to express myself in a very abstract form. And I hope you enjoyed the abstract nature of it. And hopefully, by the time I'm done with my vlog, whenever that is, when I feel I'm done with the journey, um, I hope this topic of self-discovery and spirituality, and spirituality just has to do with what's good in, I believe. It doesn't have to do with church or the mosque or praying to some spiritual power out there. Spirituality has to do with exploring this the, the power in you. That's why I say God is in you. So God is a creative one. What are you creating? Where where is that God living in you? I'm I'm, I'm Christian. I identify as a Christian. Um, so for me, God lives in me because the living word is in me. And God breathed life in me. So for you, what is yeah, that, that that's 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 the abstract nature of of those um, 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 images in my, in my articles is meant to sort of ask you if oppose a mysterious um, uh, uh, a mysterious idea or, or often try to try to spark to some questioning. Okay. Um, I'm thinking that I'm getting the edges right, but um, we always try, right? Keep trying so we get to achieve perfection. Perfection is not achieved in a day. Rome was not built in a day, as we say. Right? And Rome is beautiful. I mean, I've been there, so I can attest to it. The, 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 the Asians and the and the modern all together. It's just a, a sight to behold. And it just takes you back to how um, our 
the world was that then you see a bit of it and you're like why do people still watch those basins Whew. those big bots yeah and you're like grateful for creativity innovation you have to be grateful live a grateful life and you would never be disappointed with life So I think that sums up my yellow ochre from attempt at it. Let me show you. So again, can you see? Can you see some boat, a rowing boat? Please tell me yes. <laughs> okay. That's some more white, and then we are covering up the board. Exciting! Exciting! I'm doing white next and then blue to finish off. Okay, the green I didn't use today, which I don't like. I might just decide to paint the board green. Bear with me. Just look at the blue, you see there? To be green. I love green. And we have the Zen garden, right? And hasn't since. So, so, so there's no hard and fast room in life. And life. No hard and fast rule. Otherwise, we have fun. Just live a boring, very boring life. I'm trying to be as neat as possible. That seems to be quite a difficult. Uh, a difficult task. All right, I think the edges are about there. Um, it's not meant to be perfect, as you know. Perfection can be a disease. You know that. I grew up in an environment where my parents brought us up. I didn't realize I was a, perf I was a perfectionist and I was chasing and spending because the way I was brought up was you have to chase perfection, that's the minimum. My dad, he congratulates you for, I finished university with a cum laude. I didn't get a congratulation. Why didn't you get a 90 on average? What, what, over your four university, every year, four years. Why didn't you to get this degree? Why, why didn't you get 90% average, not 70 and something? Hmm? The upper 70s, or close to 80, north, north of 75. What, why, why only 75? Why only? So, perfection can be le actually led me down a dangerous path. But I'm glad that I'm here today. I'm glad I'm sharing this moment with you. And I hope that I'll build a relationship with, this, with you. And all that hassle will be worth it, right? All of that pain and suffering that I went through. Disappointment. I hope all of that in the end would serve a purpose, a greater purpose, a divine purpose. That's 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 what I hope for and desire. Okay. The rest of it is gonna be as fast as possible because going to be half this time I've spent with the inside because it's just the outside, it's just the horizon. Okay, let's get to it. I think if this that this can't be any I can't perfect this any more than I've tried to or fix the errors. So at some point you need to just accept what you have in front of you. Right? Like accept it. It is what it is. That's life. Accept it, accept it. <laughs> I hope that's about it.